shoots them in. But Blaze, what I'm trying to say here is, I can't really hold it against him for being uncoordinated. This is his first night in BYU. I mean, in my personal opinion, maybe Napalm would have been would have been better off teaming with Natrix. But that's just my opinion. As, oh, but impressive there by Blaze with that Huracan Rana who makes tag and then he makes tag in and to Napalm. Damn it, I can't talk tonight. Uh, uh, forgive me, guys. A lot of things have been going on in the business as of late. I mean, if you've been following, following the colleagues. And anyway, the tag is made back in. In comes Blaze. I'm not sure if that's a smart strategy by Napalm. Um, he was only in there for about 40 seconds before tagging Blaze back in. Hits a Huracan Rana, though. Two. No, two count. Damn, Blaze almost won it there. And another quick tag back to Napalm. And oh, the new Welsh Order doing what they do best. That's those double team moves. When you get caught in the new Welsh Order's corner, you're in for deep shit. And whoa! There was an example of it right there. Oh, what was that? Napalm just unceremoniously decked the referee for no reason. And what the hell? Again, yeah, at least he didn't choke slam him like him like Vader did. <laughs> but nah. But anyway. Right now the new Welsh Order is in control of this matchup. Of course they've been a dominant presence since they came to BYU. As Napalm hoists up Ryan Mooney. But wait a minute. He took a little too long and Mooney counters into an inverted DDT. Whoa, what a flying clothesline by Mooney. And I tell you what. Don't underestimate Manson and Mooney. There's a reason they are the tag team champions. I mean, the new Welsh Order better not take, take them for granted. But the new Welsh Order, the NWO, they're no slashes either. I mean, that's why they're doing as well as they have been in BYU. That's why two of them are in the Royal Showdown Tournament. And oh, wait a minute. Ow! Oh, a Schwen! That's like a Schwen. And, of course, there's the former Nova used to use it was that. And he called it the Kryptonite Crunch as Manson with a corkscrew splash and, and oh he was so close to retaining the title oh, hits a flying clothesline on napalm oh. and manson though he's gonna try for the schwen again ah oh. i don't know how it's pronounced schwen schwine and oh another corkscrew oh, break. oh but this time it was too close to the ropes and whoa, arm dragged by Manson into a boot, into a fist. And Manson, but wait a minute, and Napalm. Um, Napalm shoots him into the into their corner. Big kick. And wait a minute, Napalm. Oh! Oh, that didn't work out so well. Manson just clotheslines him and he falls off the top rope, but Napalm trips him. Trips him up here. It's a, it's a flipping splash. And now Napalm. Oh, whoa, what an interesting suplex right there. Now Napalm is going to shoot him off the ropes. Up into a hip toss. And so far the New Welsh Order has been very dominant in this bout. <coughs> Neck breaker. I'll tell you what, if they were bringing their A game, they were smart to do so. Oh! Manson, though, uh, I told you, don't underestimate them. Manson and Mooney, they know how to turn things around. Oh, and A-plus and DePetro learned that. Although the referee was chastising 
chastising Manson for whatever reason. And now he was trying to chastise Napalm. Uh, oh! Just drops him gut first across the shoulder. And uh-oh. Oh, somebody's marinating in their own ragu. We've got plasma here tonight. And oh, what a shot by, by, by Mooney on Napalm. Now he's going to hoist him up. But Napalm just fighting out of it. And he... Oh! Swinging neck breaker. And oh, wait a minute. Napalm, he's going to go up and drop the elbow. He drops the elbow and it might be over right here. Damn, he's got the cover in. Oh, it's over. I don't believe it. Man, oh, man. Hey, what a bummer for Manson and Moody, but Napalm and Blaze of the NWO just pick up the World Tag Team title. They get the win. And surprisingly, it was a clean win. Hey, I am in shock right now. We have to take a break, guys. We'll be back. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. As much as I would like to not admit it, that the new Welsh Order, er, they are now the new tag team champions, and they did win that bout out fairly. It's funny, because as I actually didn't see them, and I didn't actually see Napalm and Blaze taking any shortcuts in that match. Like Dave Williams did in his bow. Well, you're gonna here. Ah, excuse me. Hey, can't talk. But here comes Big Mike. Hey, and we got another Royal Showdown qualifier for you. Of course, Big Mike would love that opportunity. Hey, to advance all the way to the finals and go to and go to Summer Bash as the number one contender. But he's got a lot of people to go through if he wants to get there. And starting with his opponent tonight, hey, the man known as Wrath. Man, I'll tell you what, so far, so far we have had a wild night. Hey, and we've seen a new member of the NWO, according to Hoovy. He, there will be a new supremacy member and normally it's not my job how to play the guessing game but let's just try to speculate for a minute because uh, I think after thinking about it I realized who it is it's somebody it's somebody who somebody who definitely sees is Hoobie's ideals it's somebody, basically a mirror match of Hoobie. And that's somebody, and he, and that's somebody, and he is, is Repo Man! He's making a comeback! <laughs> I'm always getting, it's not the Repo Man, it's this thing that's underway. Hey, it's not Repo Man, and it's not the Gobby Gooper, it's, it's not the Goon, and, and it ain't no freaking gimmick. It ain't any gimmick, epic. And it, and it isn't, well, I'll talk about that later as Big Mike sends his wrath all the way to home plate. And, oh, damn! Big, big man like Big Mike going all the way to the top and doing an elbow to the outside and then he just <laughs> hip tosses you. I mean, Big Mike, he's one of the, he's one of the beasts here in BYU. Right up there with Cadaverous, Danny Legend, and DePetro. And ah, oh, Wrath felt that firsthand. And now Big Mike, hey, with a DDT. And he just drilled old Wrath right into the mat, and now he's gonna surfboard him. Now we're back to a standing ending position here and Big Mike is throwing shots. Oh wait a minute. He's gonna slide him again! And what is this? What is this? The water slide at Six Flags? Come on Big Mike. 
And, oh! Wrath goes right into the barricade and Big Mike's gonna hoist him up. Oh! Face first! Damn! Oh, I mean, forget about it! Hey, Big Mike is owning this match! And, oh no! He's gonna go up there! But, ah, oh, took a little too long and Rat just knocks him right off. That's what we refer to in the business as epic fail. But anyway, oh, oh, and he just fell out of out of the ring like the Indiana Jones boulder. Mm. Uh, by the way, Indiana Jones 